The four beer stores here in town are typically open on Sundays, but on the last day they can legally sell. We're seeing nothing but closed signs in the town. Looks like a ghost town. The question is whether or not those closed signs are permanent. The winds of change could be blowing through White Clay. Sunday marking an historic day for the unincorporated town of Nine, but it's unusually quiet. They've sold alcohol here every day for every Sunday for the last, I don't know how many years, you know. Former Ogallala Sioux tribal president Brian Brewer and longtime activist Frank Lemaire marching into White Clay, surprised to see all four beer stores opting out of their last day to sell. Today is a red letter day in Nebraska history and in the history of the Ogallala Lakota people. It's a good day. But they're not quite ready to celebrate, saying it's a day of remembrance for all the people who have suffered, even lost their lives on these streets. Who gives them a right to come here and put genocide on us all my life, watching my people die left and right from alcohol. Some tribal members blaming the beer store owners. I used to come to this one right here, this particular one, and when I was 15 years old, they used to sell me alcohol. Others fearful people will simply drive to nearby towns to get their alcohol. One liquor store employee in Rushville, about 21 miles south, tells me they've been busy and expect to get busier. I know the problem will move somewhere else, and I'm scared of the drunk driving, the car accidents, or people hitchhiking. While Brewer understands this is a very real possibility, his main concern is helping the people on the streets now with no alcohol. Those are our immediate concern of getting them medical help because tomorrow they're going to be hurting. Speaking of tomorrow, Brewer says they have a meeting scheduled with the tribal president at 9 to discuss the reservation's commitment to this issue as well as the possibility of bringing in additional counselors and medical staff. Reporting live in White Clay tonight, Camilla Ortiz, KETV News Watch 7.